Hello everybody, I'm Dan here from the Hammer Game Channel and welcome back to my Indian Empire playthrough in Kaiserite. But first off, I want to apologise for the lack of Hoi 4 videos this week. It's been rather poor, I do apologise for that. We are back and we are going to be asking for military access and we're going to ship out to Austria because we're still... So we'll hopefully wrap that up. Let's get an infantry anti-tank 2. Let's put a heavy focus on getting some tanks and motorised into the field. I don't know if we've actually picked any up so far. I can't remember what we last done. I think it's just infantry we currently have. It is. But that is fine. We're going to go and help. Did they reject my proposal? I was going to say, I thought they'd rejected me. Oh, the fate of Malaysia. Uh, liberate Malaysia. Liberate Malaysia and Sarawak. Get part of the Siamese friend and liberate Sarawak. Oh, I was kind of hoping to have some land for my own, but... Because owner and controller of Singapore. I'm going to liberate Malaysia because I still want to have the... They're not in exile anymore. What there? Japanese lands. What Japanese lands do I have? All neighbouring own states which are Japanese cores or claims will return to Japan. Um, I think that's the only bit that Japan wants. Yeah, it was. And, oh. And also, East... Uh, okay, that's we can have that. They are the boss. As I am. Siam wants that bit of land. But no, I've given you nothing. I'm giving you nothing. Right, anyways, we can ship out the Russia now. So we're going to just concentrate ourselves on pushing into Romania and we'll take try and take... Uh, oh gosh, I forgot how big this faction is. Now, the Austrians are kind of really not in a good place because they are on scraping the barrel and they have really low amounts of manpower left. So it depends on how their allies are doing. Like Romania has still got a decent amount. Hungary's on scraping the barrel as well. All about serve, serve by requirement, all about serve. All about serve, scraping the barrel. They're gonna be running on empty, which I do feel for them. A little. Ah, control asserted, fantastic. We do want to get all the cores by the end of this. I will sign that with Russia for the time being. Okay, they are starting to break through anyways, but we are definitely going to be assisting them. Um, are we even building ships? We might as well get the modern. Are, we are building ships, aren't we? I'm sure we are. Oh, we're building light ships. Um, advanced light ship. Oh, Galicia Lodomeria is gone. Yeah, they're going to be falling very quickly. They're really not going to withstand it. Whereabouts are we? Oh my day, we weren't even in... <laughs> we were elsewhere. We weren't actually, you know, in a position to move quickly. We are kind of using infrastructure, some of them anyways. Finish this before they even, we even do anything. So the Third International is still at war with the Entente as well, but we're not going to help them take up the Entente. It just wouldn't make any sense. I kind of want to go after the German exiles. I really do. Like, join the Entente. But they probably will join the Entente. Well, they're saying that the thing with the Entente is, um, it's literally just Canada. It's kind of embarrassing, really. They are doing our darkest hour. If they'd go and crush France instead, hilarious. I don't think they will, because, like, we could probably take them on right now. 24 divisions is not a lot. And again, I can't really be bothered fighting Africa right now. Anyways, I kind of need to get more anti-tank being produced. So we're currently making losses on that. Hey, right, we're getting there. We're currently going... Uh, what was the Turkish tank in 8? We've still got the greens are actually here. I forgot this is still ongoing. I think we could actually help win this. Kind of Romania's gone. Yeah, we're not really going to be needed over there in um, in Romania. Taking out all the options. It's not really going to be something we really need to be worried about. 
I'm going to be taking any land from it anyways. Now, I do apologize as well, because I'm going to be blowing my nose quite a lot during this. <laughs> Good old time for coal again. Oh, encirclement. Yeah, they are really running empty, but they've only got one factory, so, of course. Yeah, they're, they're dying. The Italian Republic has died. Oh, that's the Austrian front being cut in two now with the collapse. We are arriving, so we can help start pushing now. I'm going to just focus over here, though, because I really do want to wrap this up. Because that'll be China almost secure. Because the only parts we'll be missing is obviously the Russian owned bits, but the Yunnan clique is in their own Sino coalition, so they are all by themselves. Ha, they have died. Right, um, Japan, I shall give the land to you and you can give it to your your pal. Alright, let's get the last decryption. What we'll do is we'll just dump him on there. Chill there for the time being. I think our troops... Oh, gosh. We, we didn't actually have that many troops over here ready, but okay, we're helping the Russians. Probably against... You know, I should probably be helping the Austrians, but we are at war with them, so... Oh, well. And they are dying. They are really dying now. <laughs> I kind of... Can I... Uh... I would love to help, like, align myself with Russia now. I know I've literally just helped Japan. Whoa, 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 whoa. How the hell did you get Singapore? No, 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 no. That's my pop very much. No, 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 no. That is mine. Morocco has joined the Entente. Okay, development there. Oh. Germany asked to join the Entente, but I don't think they got accepted. I think the Canadians told them to bugger off. Which, if so, that is hilarious. That is anxious, and they are really going to die soon. That's not even a front line that you can draw. I think that'll do. We'll just Greece. Does Hungary count as major? Is it or it's just the Austrians? Oh, not nice. <laughs> they're still holding. How many divisions? They're still holding this front. Yeah, they're out of manpower. Follow Rome. Pile states is gone. So, oh, they've got a decent number of divisions. The national populists. The hell? I think I've ever seen them go that pop. Athens we go. We've lost 9,000 in this war. A lot of men have actually been lost during this. No, nothing compared to the 12 million. Where does the bloody 12 million come from? Who's lost the most? 1 million, 1 million. 1 million, 2 million, 1 million. Yeah, there's, okay, there's a lot. Greece is almost gone. Um... I don't really want them to be taken back Athens. We're just going to get to uh, Petras, if I've said that correctly. And we want these guys to just push on in. What are we doing equipment-wise? Because we are we are losing currently. Uh, Flanders Wallonia was annexed. And Greece has capitulated. We just need to kill this encirclement. Um, what do we want to grab? I think Vision 1. Oh, gosh. Okay, we've got the Batav Batavian commune. We're getting Flanders. Oh, we're getting F Wallon the Wallonian communal republic, and Flanders is gone. They're never coming back by the looks of things. I was actually wondering if France was just going to like annex it all. Oh, that's a nice wheel in circling in Albania. That's that's completely cut off from the port. I'd love to. It's a total casualties, 12.62. 
Yep, two Sicilies has fallen. 12.62. Let's see what the casualty is going to jump up to. The Dutch Revolution. Okay. That's odd. Okay, that was a decent encircle in there. So how much have we done? We've done 4%. Yeah, that, that's fair fair enough there. We have only just recently jumped on into it. But it's going to be the versus the Third International, I'd like to think soon. And again, I don't know if they've actually got like the ability to go to war with each other. Well, there it is. Now, I don't much, so it's just divvying it up between the Third International and the Russians. Sometimes I do wish I didn't have player -led peace conferences on. So, obviously, the Third International would definitely firstly go to Italy and sort this out. They'd, they'd take all the land. I'm going to give them a little bit extra of them. Extra land as well, I think. Right, we'll jump over to the Russians. I feel like the Russians is someone we can do pretty easily. So we'll let them take uh, Galicia and Bessarabia, Moldovia. We can take all of Romania. Give them... Give them that for the time being. Actually, we're going to have to give them those two bits of land as well. I gave that to my flipping self. Um, I'll give that to Russia. Um, I'm, just, I'm just trying to think of the best way to divvy this up. So the French... We'll give them control of Austria. And also of um, Bosnia and uh, Croatia and Montenegro. Um, however you say the country. Um, so they'll probably pop, they'll pop at that. So I think we'll give the Russians Bulgaria. And also Greece can come into their sphere. Hungary can just be chopped up between the two, I think. I don't know if that's going to look hideous. But we'll find out in a second. That is. So the rest is going to the French. Bohemia, take all states. France, Kingdom of Serbia, take all states. Take the blue bits of Hungary. Okay, I think we've created a fairly decent and fair front between the two because they were the two that brought them down. The war with the Pope, but he's dead as well. So obviously that's going to go to Italy. Where is a socialist Italy? So Italy is whole under the socialists near enough. Sardinia is only part that remains free. So I think that's been divvied up fairly. I don't know what you guys think, but I think that's okay. So we've got the Socialist Republic of Yugoslavia. The Austrian People's Republic. That's Italian, so we will give that to them. What? How are you justifying against me? Expel Japanese off. Oh my days! They're revolting. They are actually going to be revolting. Oh my gosh! Everybody, and I mean all of my divisions. You sir, you too. Get over here. We have a revolt potentially. I think that's what that's going to be. It says dire consequences with uh, the relationship with Japan. And if it's expelling their officers, that's just going to pee them right off. So we get them over and we're just going to... No, we can't even draw that enough. Let's see what's happening in Europe, though. I d why have you not given... Republic. Uh, the Kingdom of Hungary is here. I might have to do some further um, helping out. 
We have this here. I might just have, I'm gonna have to give that to the Hungary. Austria got given German West Hungary, so that's fine. It's fine by me. Um, is Albania and Bulgaria gonna come back? Occasions. Empire of Japan is just fine on Australia. Okay, it looks like we're going to the war with the Entente. That is completely fine by me. <laughs> Japan had a fairly strong fleet. And, um, well, I'm not just taking a, a complete and utter guess here, but I feel like the Canadian fleet is most likely going to be at the opposite side. And, oh, well, they do have control of the Panama Canal, so their fleet could be anywhere. I was going to say, because we can make a landing on the Argo in. Did you give up expelling the op They've done it. They have done it. Okay, that's not had the consequences I thought it was going to have, unless Japan just hasn't responded to it just yet. Right, we have one spare factory. Uh, and our 12 divisions, on you go. Get to the front. Okay, Bulgaria is, um, well, complete control of Serbia, which I think is great. Really great. They, I don't know why they've got that. Um, control of Serbia, good. Bulgaria just looks weird. Serbia's just gone. Um, so, everyone's been puppeted now. So, if we look at the factions, England <laughs> is. Look how road packed though. We could help oh, them out and help them out actually. The clear one, Turkey. Oh, Turkey. Yep, they're going to secure the uh, Bosphorus Strait now. The plan will be. Has now that. I think we can probably get some tanks out. See, steel. We're getting a lot of steel from the Russians currently. We could probably pick up some from the US. Well, we can definitely pick up some from the US. Um, tanks. How would we do for them? We do not. We'll come back to that. I'm not going to get them just yet. I'm going to wait because I don't think we actually... Um, oh, Luxembourg's even here now. Charles Marx. The Swiss just looks so screwed. Ireland stayed out of this. Like, out of it all. A for uh, Japan's invasion of Australasia. Uh, the Australasian uh, Confederation. I feel like that is the idea. Because we could set our... Well... Hmm... It's a long journey. Journey. We should be we should be building subs. We should build subs. Don't know if we're gonna be able to do Canada. Um, who else is in the Entente? Because we could strike at them. Brazil. Brazil is gonna be a tough guy to take down. Hopefully they're not a major. Because if they're a major, why Japan? Japan! You indels! Oh! The question is, see if I leave Japan, does this open back up? Oh. Oh, I'm very, very tempted. They're not gonna- Oh! Italy! Do I abstab them? Oh! Ho, ho, ho! Do I backstab them? Oh, crikey! I don't know. I don't know. Do I backstab them or not? I might just leave this episode here and let you guys decide. Because they're not going to beat the... They may elsewhere because they've just had the... just had their wars. They've only got 96 divisions, Japan. We have 96. 108. We can definitely... We've got to take out Siam again. Well, we've got to push through Siam and into China again, I mean. Oh, decisions, decisions, decisions. So, guys, I'm going to leave that episode there. So... Let me know. Actually, I might even try and put a little poll thing in. So the little I button or whatever. Um, I'll put a poll in on the video. And we'll see how it does. And then I'll do whatever that says. Okay? So thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. And I'll be back very soon for some more. Take care.